A long time ago, in year six, I was lonely. I had no friends. Lunch times, I was alone. Break times, I was alone. Even when we had to get into teams, I was alone. It wasn't fun. But one day, this tall blonde girl came up to me and asked if I would like to help create a road safety assembly for year one and two. I obviously said yes right away. So we got started on it. I got laptop and this girl said, why don't you type and create a presentation? Because you're really quick at typing. I said yes. We spent a good two weeks on it. Or should I say, I spent two weeks on it. Now on the day of the assembly, we got to come out of class to practice. And when I got there, I opened the laptop, opened the script. Then she told me I had been replaced. She only wanted me for my ideas. I felt ashamed and mad at the same time. I tried making an argument, but whatever came out of my mouth was completely different to what I was thinking. I accepted the fact that I was betrayed. The next day went by, and this tall blonde girl came into class with a big smile on her face. The presentation was so good, she was asked to go on tour around town to present the same assembly. But she was also a little worried, because only I had access to the script, so she had nothing to work with. She asked if I could open it for her, but I said no. She had to go to another school that day, and she had nothing. The time came to the assembly. She walked up on stage. She opened her big mouth and cried. She knew what she had done and betrayed me. She was made a laughing stock. Everybody found out what she had done, and my classmates suddenly started to talk to me and wanted to play with me. From that day onwards... I had friends. Oh my god, and we totally jumped off the cliff and had to swim all the way to shore because the dog chased us all the way to the head.